4th third grade classes created their own Minecraft communities using social studies concepts and skills. The students were divided into groups of 3 to 4. How do we, as a group, build the perfect community? What does this perfect community have? What does this community look like? And how do we carry out this task? Students were given a community folder that contained a constitution document and a sheet that contained reflective learning questions. They used their tablet computer and Minecraft app to create their digital communities. Teachers also had to create a Schoology group where students reflected on their learning. First, students had to fill out their constitution document. It contained questions about culture, roles of members, adaption to environments, citizenship, rules, governing power, and authority. They researched these topics as well as have group and classroom discussions. It is recommended that the teacher model this process prior to having the groups work on the document individually. During two consecutive class periods each week, students completed three tasks. The objectives had to include one of the concepts listed in their constitution document. Okay, I want you to go to Schoology. I want you to go to the uh, group blogs and I want you to write down the objective you have for the group today. The group objective. After you have written down your group objective, I want you to write down your individual objectives. Groups entered their Minecraft world and tried to carry out their group and individual objectives. While students played, teachers took on the role as facilitators. Going around to each group, guiding them to approach the activity correctly, focusing on key concepts involved in creating an ideal community. EdTech specialists also were in hand to facilitate student learning as well as provide tech support. After playing Minecraft for 40 minutes, students reflected on their learning experience. They were provided with prompt questions that help them focus on key concepts as well as make meaning of what they learned. After the completion of their communities, groups went back and revised their constitution document. This document was their final product and was ultimately shared with the other groups. Finally, the teachers led a class discussion on how the needs and concerns of the different cultural groups were both similar and distinct. You can find the standards used for the unit in the description below.